Republican Ron Paul has cautioned that America is going to meet a sudden, calamitous end, and contrasted the United States in 2018 with the last days of the Roman Empire. In an upheaval live on TV the Texas delegate contended the times of U.S. strength on the worldwide stage are numbered, and the end won't be beautiful. He stated, the way I see it is in financial terms. My comprehension is that it wasn't our military develop in the United States that cut the Soviet framework down. What happened was the Soviets were working with a framework that we, individuals and free markets, saw as absolutely unviable. While the U.S. economy is on the up, the government official asserted the nation's militarism that could prompt their inevitable destruction. He proceeded, we're going to have a sudden, disastrous end which is kind of the end result for the Soviet framework. It won't be indistinguishable, there was a progression development and some of those nations left the Soviet framework. Our states most likely wouldn't separate. Yet I do truly trust that we will never again have the capacity to bear the cost of a realm around the globe. Express reports, the U.S. is associated with various clashes the world over, including the battle against ISIS in the Middle East. Since getting to be president Donald Trump has likewise invested a lot of energy concentrating on North Korea. And also sending various tweets regarding the matter. He has additionally tended to the issue in a discourse at the United Nations and in a deliver toward the South Korean Assembly. Mr. Paul included, our realm, in spite of the fact that we don't assert possession to it, it's a great deal of cash and a considerable measure of impact, and we debilitate with weapons and we utilize a sense to hold our domain together, yet I surmise that is reaching an end. Trump has additionally debilitated to haul the U.S. out of NATO if different nations neglect to respect their responsibility regarding pay to for each penny of their GDP on safeguard spending. He has additionally said he will haul out of worldwide exchange ascensions, for example, the North American Free Trade Agreement with Canada and Mexico, contending that it is a terrible arrangement.